Get ready to pay more at the gas pump after a record one-month jump in prices. The state will likely approve a tax increase tomorrow. Yeah, we want to show you the recent spike. Now take a look. San Diego's averages are in blue, national averages in red. Right now we're paying 4.27 a gallon. That is a huge jump from last month, about the same as last year you can see down here. But always, can you see this? Well above the national average, and that may get even worse. Now new at 6, 10 years reporter Craig Herrera reveals how much more you may soon be paying just in taxes. When it comes to fueling at the pump, Selena Zhang likes to shop around. It's a little hard for just and really demanding trying to pick out gas stations, like what's cheaper, what is not. Drivers can look at the gas prices on signs by the road, but what they can't see is the amount they'll pay in taxes. That adds up to about 70 cents per gallon. It really adds up and um, taxes on sales, taxes on clothes, like taxes on you know, gas now, you know, so it, it's, it's a little tough. And it's about to get a little tougher. Tuesday, the State Board of Equalization will consider a three and a half cent increase on what's called the excise tax. It generates funds to maintain roads, bridges, and infrastructure. If the rate is hiked, California will lead the country in having the highest gas taxes. A California, and specifically a San Diegans, have done a great job in buying more of these fuel efficient cars. However, when it comes to an excise tax, that's not necessarily good news. The excise tax is based solely on gallons. So the state's finance department tries to forecast how many gallons of fuel will be sold each year. But since Californians are making fewer stops at the pump, the state is losing money. There was a $157 million shortfall in gas tax revenue last year. We really lose the benefit, if you will, of being a volume-based tax through an excise tax by having to do the look back. Every day, every week, you just have to decide on like, oh, should I spend more on groceries or should I spend more on gas? If passed, the average motorist will be shelling out an extra 26 bucks at the pump this year. In Kearney Mesa, Craig Herrera, 10 News. 10 News will be following that vote tomorrow. We're gonna let you know what happens. We're also helping you in the meantime, find the cheapest gas prices. Just log on to 10news.com and click on that traffic section for a map of your neighborhood gas stations.